Hello everyone, welcome back to Xenoblade Chronicles. So we just got a new character, Amelia. And she has a very interesting combat style. And I gotta say this about this game. This game has definitely kept the combat interesting. Between like all these different mechanics that kind of play into the combat, the um the the Monado to deal with Mechon, the whole um what? I don't remember the name of the three different attacks. The whole thing that's setting up for uh, knockdowns, the whole chain attacks, and everyone behaves a little bit differently. You don't like have two tank characters that do the exact same. You've got a tank character that's all about um, mitigating damage. You got a tank character that's all about dodging. So you know, everyone's a little different, and she is by far the most different person, um, different combat system we've seen. She's glass cannony, and she summons elementals, and then. Um, and then flares them with elemental discharge. So it, it feels a lot like the machine in uh, Stay the Spire. Anyway, um, before we go on, let's check. Okay, we have new arts or something? Shulk has a new art. Yeah, he got Purge. Which lets him remove enemy auras and spike. So probably we're going to start seeing them a bunch. I wanted to check our quest. See if there's anything we need to be doing. We do have a bunch of quests back at Colony 9. There are not so many at Colony 9. We have a bunch at Colony 6. But for this, we have just a gift. Okay, we just need to find this person. They're probably somewhere ahead. I don't know. This one, though. We need to still fight these Machna X. We haven't found that one yet. Those yet. Where are they? Okay, they're up ahead of us. Perfect! And, um, now that we have her, we are having some trouble with our max level. Because she can't go below 34. So 34 is our new minimum. We're gonna we need to find some enemies that can actually, you know, give us XP at 34. some sort of a thing on your back? An Inferno Dinos. Prepare yourselves. Leave it to Roy. So I will summon no. Aqua, then summon Flare, then summon Gold. And now I just wait. I don't really have anything to do. I wait till I can do one of these again. Not that one. I'm sure there's a better way to do this. I haven't figured it out yet. But I'm feeling like we're doing good damage, even though we're just kind of sitting back. I can't let that one slip by. The head. Shoot him in the head. What? What did I say? Ali hoop. Anyway, we have got. I don't really feel like this is the best party. Um, I don't think we need Sharla at the moment because I have got the healing. Maybe if we had someone else as a backup healer, we could do fine. But I would need to get her relationship up with us so that we can do a quest. Uh, the X are down this way. Hmm. There they are. Level 31, so could be worse. Okay, let's go ahead and put fire on them first. And so the healing, bolt, no way. Just gonna get this burn for a little bit. Go help, please. My wife is getting closer. Now we're getting started. Ryan, don't jump the gun now. Oh yeah, baby. Mine. Oh yeah. Now. Now it's. Now 
got three up. So we got this explosion. Okay, begin with the... Uh, I guess I could pop. Nah, just, just smack him. Witness my true power. Our healing is fine, we don't need to do that, so we'll just pop. So we got lightning, water, water. Very strange place to help. I'm kind of passive. Take bullets! Yeah! Right? I feel the ether. Building within me. Oh, now Summon. it's right time. Fire! Alright, now it's But I feel like we're doing good damage. Because we're getting where we have this like grievous flame on it. My life is getting hotter. Get up. Get up. Witness my power. Okay, never mind. I don't know, I might get a little bored with it. It's an interesting system. I wish I had more things to um to to summon, because we spent a lot of time passing. Okay, can we just fight one of you this time? Because, I mean, it's about to come up and I don't need it. Oh no, now we're off. Okay, so it's probably about the same time. So pop that. Let's, uh, pop that. Like, I imagine that getting that dot of time. Was that the handiwork of Ryan? I see life outside my world is not easy. Let's keep on going like this, guys. Who else wants some? All right. There's a heart to heart down there. We go look at it if we can. Might not be able to do it yet, but we can get it registered. I might want to put up um, lightning first, because then I'll have ether up when I cast that first fire damage. Get 
She doesn't even have good gear on, right? Uh, did I learn a skill? No. Shulk did. Shulk learned. Burst affinity fills more of the gauge. That's that's pretty awesome. I want that. Increased chance of a chain link is good too. Maybe I want to get this just so we could actually spend more time doing it. <laughs> like I haven't looked at our gem crafting in a long time. There, go ahead and get that. So, lightning first, then fire, then burn the fire. Put up the water. Did that affect both? Yeah, we have, it must have an area of effect. Burn the water. Put up another lightning. Water. Yeah, definitely hits both. Nice. Like, I'm actually pulling aggro off right. So I'm doing good damage. To the point where I'm dying, actually. <laughs> <laughs> only now have you realized our true power. Let's keep on going like this, guys. Who else wants some? Alright. Sparkling pool, secret area. Nice. Okay, we actually see what this requirement is. It's not that far away. So I just need them to have a bit more friendship. Pretty water. today. New skills. Dunban learned Mind of the Warrior. Uh, you definitely want to go for this. I think that's like the next, the most important thing for you. Change time to morning. But yeah, I need more clickies. Like right now, I'm mostly just rotating between three abilities. Whereas most of my... Well, that's not true. I guess the difference is that I don't have to move into, um, into like melee range. As opposed to like, Shulk is mostly rotating between three abilities also. It's just, he has to be moving all the time to adjust whether he is, um, is facing. Should I go north and try to check out all that? I think not yet. I'm betting we're gonna get sent to do more in the world. Don't let a single one escape. Stop water. Burn our water, put up another car. Our bolt. There's the final. Flawless victory. 
Still nice. What a bunch of jokers. We make a great team. So she got ether up. Just flat ether up. Poison time up. I don't have poison yet. Strength during the night. So probably we should switch to something more relevant. I'm not feeling the water arts. So maybe we should go over here. Increased agility. I don't have wind either. So we're going to get a poison summoning or a poison spell and a wind spell. I don't have yet. I just aggroed a second person. My bad. Ryan, help. Help. Like, I feel like I'm not doing very much, but I'm pulling aggro, so I'm, I must be doing good damage. We pulled a... What do I have? I have lightning. Here, lightning. Let's go. But yeah, I'm liking this character. She has a very interesting playstyle. And I'm getting into it. And she has like one of the few AoE abilities in the game. Uh, do I need to go up here? I might. Nah, not, not really, but whatever. Nice to see Ryan out here again. I haven't, I haven't run, run, been running with him very much lately. There's a heart to heart up there. Uh, 
Come on, we can jump up that. No, we can't. do this one yet. How do I get up there? We have to go all the way around to get up there. I think we'll wait for now. I don't think we have any, uh, an excuse to do it. I keep assuming that we're going to get one. Twisted Tree Gate. But so far the game's been pretty good at like having high level areas that you can't go to. Oh. Okay, we need to kill that guy actually. He's not, you know, he's big, but he's not high level. Uh, okay. Ooh, Th that one's a bit bigger. There's this big little, this big. Okay, there's a path full of giants that you have to avoid. Interesting. We want to go south, so I'm just going to check this area first real quick. Talk to this person. Okay. Sorry. That's a big one. Lakelet a mammoth. Big endgame creature. Yes, no. Yes, no. Entrance to Frontier Village. <laughs> so, this big tree is where the Nopon live. Ah, Bird Lady! Welcome back, Bird Lady! I wish to speak with the village chief. Will you permit us to enter? My pleasure! My pleasure! I shall take you to the village chief. Follow me. That's a lot of no fun. Hum hum. Me want nibble hum hum. Um. Hum hum taste. Pew. <laughs> hum hum scary. Oh. 
Nopon of Frontier Village. Melia Antigua has returned. I request an audience with your chief. Chief, will you hear my request? Melia here. Bad lady here. <laughs> Melia back. Bird lady back. Bird lady? <laughs> my dear Melia, <laughs> it's good to see you again so oh soon. And you look so well. And what of your men? They are at one with the Bionis. They sacrifice their lives so that I might escape. But this is not my reason for coming. These Homs need your help. Will you be so kind as to listen to their request? What could a Hom Hom need of me? They require safe passage to Aerith Sea. I see no reason to deny them. And Melia, what of you? I have unfinished business in this region. Once these Homs are safely on their way, I shall be on mine as well. No, that's not gonna happen. That girl. Something's troubling her. We found her half dead and all alone. But I don't suppose she'll tell us the reason anytime soon. Maybe we can help. I'll go and talk to her. There's so many people around here. Okay, new quest. Let's not take the quest until we get Melia back. Because we need to build Melia and um, Charlotte's friendship. Kind of sucks to be hero pop. <laughs> Piki must practice boyoying. Bitey, bitey, happy, happy, sneaky, play dead. Uh, that was Riki. To, okay, so I guess we're gonna get someone named Riki. Behave. Hero time. We're gonna get a no pun. Spoilers. the wrong way though we need to go up but we'll get these blues while we're here uh they just disappeared what if we change time back a little bit now they're back Empress Beetle 3 for Colony 6. I think I remember that, that we need them. Let's actually switch time to way earlier in the day. So we can do this all during the day. Ha! 
Jump in from above. Ah, uh, let's let's. Wait a minute. There's a there's an arrow going up. Okay, that's where we need to go. Let's just get to the next waypoint and get Melia back on side, and then we can run around as her. No, that that was that we just left. Whoops. That was not an up arrow. That was a zone transition area arrow. Yeah, look how many floors there are. Okay. Uh, there's the staircase. Let's go up that way. Extra stuff for Sharla. And for everybody. I, I think I might have missed a few of those at some of the earlier shops. I just never bothered to check. I keep thinking those are these little green things everywhere are pickups, but they're not. They're like the same, uh, close to the same shade though. See, not the green ones, but these little blue ones right here. That one was one. Okay, never mind. Heart to heart, we can't do yet. Can I jump on this one? Ricky's house. Okay, we'll be back later, I'm sure. It's an early warning system because the moment the moment we get attacked, he's gonna run away. So if you see him running, you know to run after him. I don't know. They said to jump on those, but it doesn't seem to be working. Uh, wait, 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 that's the wrong way. I need to go up. to heart. I can't do you. Melia, 
You're welcome to come with us. Is it true? Were you alone in the forest? <laughs> that thing must be stopped by my hand. This is my pledge to those that have died. Is it... wounded? I see. The Telethia is hurt and lies in rest, wounded by a girl. Wounded by a girl? You don't mean you're going to fight the Telethia? <gasps> How do you know of the Telethia? When I went to collect the Aether Crystals, some Telethia attacked me. I managed to destroy them and get away. You defeated Telethia? Who... who are you? The Monado. So that sword can... To tell the truth, they were the Telethia spawn. Someone told me the primary Telethia is healing somewhere in the forest. It was you, wasn't it? You hurt the Telethia. It... Melia... The Telethia escaped from our homeland, and I am tasked with killing it. It cannot remain free. For the sake of my people and the Nopon, it must be stopped. Melia, we can help you defeat it if you like. Out of pity? No. Why then? It's just... I... I want... Speak, Shulk. Or I shall be forced to summon the Nopon chief to interpret for me. I... would like to help. What could you possibly gain from aiding me? I saw it. At the top of a black tower. You and I were fighting together. Fighting that faced Mekon. I also saw you fighting a huge Telethia. It threw me the first time and all. Forgive me, Shulk, but what are you talking about? Shulk can see visions of the future. See the future? And you expect me to believe this rubbish? Believe what you want, lady. Same as I tell all the non-believers. <laughs> That'll be me, then. Oh, yeah! In any case, the only reason we got this far was because of Shulk's visions. If Shulk says he saw you in a vision, then you must be important to whatever happens next. And if you're tough enough to fight a face mech on, you're all right in my book. You've got my vote. A lady should not go unaccompanied onto the battlefield. Excuse me? I... I am quite capable of dispatching the beast alone. I require no assistance of any kind. My dear, I apologize, but I could not help overhearing. Their offer sounds quite reasonable. The danger extends much further than our small dwelling. Machna itself is at risk. And we shall provide you with the finest warrior of our clan. Chief Dunga, I... Uh, no need for thanks. <laughs> he is the equal, if not better, of the Hom Hom. You do know we're listening. The chosen Nopon hero will await you below. I shall go ahead and prepare him. Please excuse me. A Nopon hero? Now this I have to see. Don't be like that. Let's meet him first. Okay. Maybe we should wait still, because we're going to get Riki, and then we can run around with Riki and get all the, um, all the quests. So you got this physical defense up. You're going to this increased ether. That's fine. And you got increased agility. That's a great one. Boost wind damage. I mean, of these three, poison, wind, <coughs> or wind, I have no idea which one I need. Here, go for poison. <laughs> Sorry, Charla. Okay, I'm gonna do it. Oh my god. <laughs> I 
I didn't change the party. So I want Melia and Ryan. Now let's just warp to the front. May I introduce Herapon Ricky? Oh, what's that? Get off me! Oh, to you! Uh, oh, uh, uh, right in the... Take this, bubble! Oh, that's not good. Uh, against the daddy version. No one blink for a second. Okay. Eyes wide open. And don't forget that Melia is our only chance of making it to Aerith's sea. If anything happens to our guide, it's on our heads. The Telethia is our target. But don't forget about the person standing next to you. Dumbans right. I am in your debt. My weaknesses are all too apparent. No worries, Melia. Formed of the Dino Beast, what you refer to as the Telethia. Be safe, my hum hum friends. Ricky's friends, listen to Ricky. Dino Beast is big and scary. Friends, get ready. Friends, help Ricky get ready. You want us to get equipment for you? Ricky's friend, right? Hum hum clever. Friends meet Ricky when ready. Then, friends and Ricky leave together. Big attitude for a furry footrest. Dino Beast is big and scary. Great. That'll come in handy. Is it just me, or did we suddenly become Nopon mercenaries? Collect Ricky's weapon and armor. <laughs> Maybe not quite that good. I don't have a landmark thing. Just walk up.
ready to go. Come, new friends. Ricky's adventure begins. Ricky, you do know where the Telethia is, don't you? Of course, Ricky, no. Melly, Ricky here you hurt Dino Beast. I did, but only a little. When Dino Beast hurt, Ricky know it go to place with ether crystals. Friends and Ricky go to place with crystals. Then we find Dino Beast. Chief, tell Ricky. Chief, always right. So you do know a thing or two about this monster. Guess we'll be searching for some ether crystals then. Ricky, why are you the hereupon? Why? Because Chief Dunga chose Ricky. He chose you? So you weren't chosen from birth? Friend wrong. Chief chose by instinct. <coughs> by instinct? Why, friend surprised? Chief have sharp instinct. Chief be village seer. So that's how you became the hereupon. Can't argue with that. But he is kind of... compact. For a warrior hero. Oh, Ricky owe lots of monies to village. <laughs> if Ricky defeat Dino Beast, village promise to forget my debts. So Ricky like being hero pon. Okay, let's change. So we can we have an entirely new person. We just need to look at them. But let's first of all get them in the party. Um. We need to have Charlotte and Melia together. But let's see if Ricky can do that. Let's take a look at him. So, well, wait, wait, wait. first of all, do we have a new help thing? Tutorial. Wait a minute, I have a new option. Stealing. Show notifications when Ricky's yoink is successful. Sure. Okay, um, tutorial, battle tactics, Ricky, Ricky's talent is yoink, <laughs> you can take nasty monsters, items, strength, and HP, that's really nifty, <laughs> Ricky's happy happy fills the party gauge. Making it easier to revive anyone who's coming incapacitated. Then we can all be heroes. Bitey, bitey, and lurgy. Very deadly. Cause damage over time. Really scary. So use them at the start because then they deal dots. Okay. Anything else new? No. Let's take a look at your arts. So are you a DPSer? I guess. Riki sneaks up from behind, dealing lots of damage. Damage. The back attack. Bites out, inflicting bleed. From behind, extends the duration, so twice as much. Lurgy, chews poisonous grass, grass, and spits it out in a cloud. So he's he's kind of a mage character. Kind of a no. He's kind of a. I don't know, it's kind of both. Behave. Throws petals, making the enemy placid. Infects paralysis. Freezinate. Instantly freezes an enemy, which chills them. Roly poly. The bigger you are, the harder you fall, and it topples. Interesting. It just, just topples? It doesn't actually need like the the earlier version, the the days or whatever. Interesting. Happy, happy. You can do it. Restores HP to the whole party. The more debuffs, the more HP restored. Interesting. Hero time. Prevents tension from decreasing. Increases a stat at random by seventy-five percent. 
Nifty. Play dead. <laughs> Enemies ignore him, allowing a surprise attack. Heals the same HP as genuine revival. Then you get five seconds of extra damage. Okay, wait a minute. Take all these off. And let's figure out how we want to make this happen. So you've got you've got a couple of dots that we need to get on really early. Then you've got your standard attack, which is sneaky and freezinate. So that's a that's a fifteen second. And that's a ten second. But like those are your basic, you know, that's your that's your basic um, pattern. Behave. Now is paralysis? I don't know. So um, it's not a mez. It's not sleep. It's paralysis. Let's put this over here. Maybe we can use it. I don't know. Definitely want to try this out to see if we can just make topple every 60 seconds. Happy, happy. Use that all the time. And then you have a heal. What do I What do I not have? I don't have hero time. The, the 30 second buff. Or play dead. I don't think we need play dead. I don't really want that. But hero time I do want. And this is actually an AoE, this Lurgy. We can give out Behave, I think. We can give away Behave. So you've got... You've got... Ah. You've got your two debuffs you play right at the beginning. Then you go through this rotation. You use this whenever you can. Do this whenever you can. And then these are situational cooldowns. I like it. He starts with a whole bunch of AP. So, like we said, um, get these two up first. So he's a DPS who specializes in dots. That's kind of what I'm getting. Or, um, debuffs. Three is an eight. And sneaky. Then I like happy, happy. I mean, you're only gonna be able to use it once per battle, but that's fine. And we're out. By your skills. So, Innocence, Ether Defense, Movement Speed, always the same AP. Oh! Oh, we should go for that All right, right away. So, apparently, I, I guess I guess people that are in the back don't get the same AP, except for this, except for if they get this. Maximum HP, strength during the day, allows low value items to be offered when trading. I barely do any trading. We should look at the things we can trade and just see if it's worth doing it. Chance of dropping silver chests. And increased XP. He's got some weird abilities, so he's got increased AP, XP, um, drop rates, trading. Allows items to be sold for a higher price by 20%. That's that's not minor. That's not nothing. And again, rewards the same XP regardless of participation. XP is not as important because most of our time, most of the XP we get, we get from questing. I get the impression, or landmarks, or kind of thing. But AP, we get only from battles. Let's Riki steal AP with Yoink. Wow. Grants immunity to strength down is useless. Let's Riki steal XP. 
Um, interesting. So, okay. He kind of has a whole bunch of abilities that make it so he's okay being in the back line. Like, not the active person. But then he also has lots of really good abilities that benefit the entire party. I don't know. So all he's got right now is increased strength during the day. Can we, can we link you to anything? Agility, heal, ether up. Ether up. Reduced weight. Uh, do you already have medium equip, okay? Wait a minute. Can he not use medium equipment? So... No. He can only use light. Interesting. Now I'm assuming we're not going to find medium equipment that's actually better than what he's wearing. Though I'm... I, I'm wrong. Someone else has it. I didn't even look at Melia's equipment. I need to do that too. And I should okay, this is figure out your your fashion. So you've got this thing, it looks ugly as hell. This I kinda like that. That, that that's better. What else do we got then? Uh I'd like to do that one more. Hats. <laughs> He's a cheerful little dude. And these are terrible hats. I can't even see what this is. I kind of like that. <laughs> no. Too spiky. Ooh, he's all striped. These are going these are on his little wings. I think we'll just go with this leg art type. It seems to be working out nicely across the board. Gives him a nice nice look. Alright. Uh and Melia, we haven't looked at your you yet. So we only have the one staff. You're stuck with that for now. I kinda like this coloring. Here, we might not use that. We'll keep looking. But that's some interesting color. Uh Uh, that's not bad. I don't really like it though. Gloves. You know, we can't even see anything. Um, let's, 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 like, give her nothing for now until we can see the, her how her pants look under that. 
Alright, what am I even seeing? Here, switch everything off. I guess that's just part of her, that's her base underwear. That's kind of nice. It's all poofy at the wrist. Like colony type 2 might be what we just want to do across the board. It seems to look really good. If it all matches. Oh, these are very nice though. I like this middle type. Like that, perhaps. So we know we're gonna give her this, uh, that, as her chest. What is even changing here? It must be underneath the, the skirt. Like that? So that's the matching set. Let's compare that to middle type, whatever it was. I think I like that better. Yeah. And your hat? I can't change your hat. For some reason, it's locked. So we can't. You're, you're going to be wearing that hat the entire time, I suppose. And gloves. So that re this replaces some outfit, parts of her outfit. It gets rid of her cloak. I think I like the full shoulders. So instead we should maybe go with just, just these. That's a fine look. Here, we have anything we can give you? No, just the same stuff. Oh wait, I'm, I'm not even I'm not even looking at the right thing. I should get to say all, so we can review it. Yes, you can't change your hat. Weird. All. She's more likely to be hit by either attacks, probably, unless she pulls aggro. So I don't think I like that trade-off. So much of this blaze defense. I don't know why, why we have those. But um, in terms of your gear, you want ether up stuff. So Charlotte has that, but I think it's better on you. And maybe... I 
I don't know. We probably I'll just give her XP up for now. Because she has the least XP. Alright, and Riki. I stole this from you, I need to give you something else. You can have the APS. Riki. Clearly better. So your defense are okay. So like you're right now, your um, physical depth is 219 compared to 217, 260, 384, 209. So you're actually you know kind of in the bottom end. You're squishy. I think he kind of fills the same role as Shulk. <laughs> that's the that's the vibe I'm getting. Possibly other people do need stuff, but we're good for now. I'm not sure this party can survive. Like, we don't have a tank. But we can at least run around with it for now. Was that a new tutorial? No, that was the how to use Reaper. Alright, let's go talk to like everybody now. Get a bunch of quests. Yes, no. You use time mushrooms. Okay, so find mushrooms, BM compost. Kinda did, man. Oh, fine. Whoopee! Bash three Terra or Lugas. Those are the big giants. Whoopee! And Amos or Luga. Luga? <laughs> and now I think I do need to buy these. I'm not sure in the party. Ghost every night from underground. Yeah. 
Gotcha, friendio. Leave it to us, mate. <laughs> That's how she thinks the rest of us talk all the time. Friendio. Zolos run like wind. Probably it's a special. about these pollen orbs. I guess it kind of makes sense. Brace it for your girlfriend. Doba Doba. Monsters are causing trouble. Grab yellow pollen and yellow flower. This one's fine, never mind. I still can't tell me. Probably it's because they require you to progress past this point. Yeah. You lost your homemade hook. Find the dino hook. Huh. 
Big wriggly crawler. Oh dear. Bash the lazy Bruco. Only at night. Hello. You want some pets? You want ash foxes? We have plenty of them. It is done. Very jammy. Wee. Okay, so we're just getting different relationships. Maybe once we complete the quests, we'll be able to um, find a friendly girl for her. Very delicious sounding name. Ah. Is that the berry girl? <laughs> ah. Berry jammy.
Nothing, all right. Did we miss anything? Oh, we must have, because we didn't get all the time flowers. But did we miss any quests? Grab the materials for a secret Nopon elixir. Hades beetles, all seeing eyes, and potent broad poison. We have a few of all those things. And I guess we'll get more. market. Uh, we want to... I need to do this too, so mark that one. Oof. Sudden twinge in my legs. Sorry about that. There was a place where there was a dude jumping on one of those flowers. Where is it? Where are my flowers? Mushrooms. Something else is happening here. Hello? Yeah. Ah! I have a package for you. We have them. Yes, no. You're not jumping, so that's not the right one.
And we're back down to ground level. Hmm. New quest, though. Must have been not available at night. Or in the day. But now it's available because it's nighttime. Fancy Orluga mask from Orlugas. have all eight yet. We'll get them eventually. <laughs> Alright, I know we still have a few more things to get, but I gotta admit, this is a little tedious. Um, I think I'm gonna take a break here. We'll continue tomorrow. Right, we're at the hour and a half mark. So thank you everybody for watching. Until next time.